how about the, the deepest group, the most talented position group in your opinion? Yeah, I'm going to go with the D-line, man. It, you know, you got Corey Foreman and JT Tui Molau at Eastside Catholic. Those are the number one and number two recruits in just about any recruiting site you're going to look at and both well-deserved, man. You look at Corey Foreman down in the 951 in the Inland Empire, Corona Centennial. Now, a guy I compare him to is Chase Young, who was the number two overall pick for the Washington. Not sure what to call him right now, but he's a, a big-time defensive end, very strong, very physical, quick off the edge. And, uh, you know, he's the best player in high school football when you're talking about defensive linemen. Corey Foreman, big-time guy. He's the reason why Corona Centennial starts the year ranked at number 15 in our preseason top 25. Now I just hope that we're able to get football in California this fall. But you just look at the tape of Corey Foreman. He's explosive off the jump, and uh, he knows how to get to the quarterback. And then you got JT Tuimolau, Eastside Catholic. He's helped them win back-to-back 3A state titles. And I know Ohio State fans are, are getting excited for JT because they think he's going to end up going there. He's still uncommitted, so we'll have to wait and see with that one. But then you also got Mason Smith, big-time defensive end, and Jack Sawyer, a 2021 Ohio State commit, joining those two on the first team selections for the D-line.